Okay, this is a question from uh, the homework on factoring a difference of squares. Uh, you may run into this problem. And so I want to take uh, some time and go over this uh, question. So the first thing we want to look for here is a common factor. Always just look for a common factor. Look at the numbers 81 and 49 and there's nothing that we can take out of those guys. However, when we start looking at the variables, we have a P cubed in one term and a single P. We have a Q and a Q cubed. So we can factor both a P and a Q out of each of those terms. So we start by doing that. When we do that, we're left with 81 P squared minus 49 Q squared. Now that we've uh, factored out that common factor of PQ, we can now look at what's left and see, well, can we factor that any further? Well, we have 81P squared minus 49Q squared. 81 and 49 are both squares, as is P squared and Q squared, so, and that is, so that is a difference of squares. So we can continue. And then to get 81, we'd have to take 9 squared. To get p squared would be p, so it'd be 9p. And then 7q. And 9p plus 7q. And then that would be our answer. pq times 9p minus 7q times 9p plus 7q.